Hello viewers, today in this video I will show you how to use the Prolog software. Now uh, Prolog software is uh, basically used in the field of artificial intelligence. Now uh, this is used for uh, checking the syntax as well as the semantics of the web application. Now uh, what this you see right here is called as the uh, SW Prolog uh, the command interface or where you execute the all the commands. Now uh, for creating any new file click on this file uh, go to new and create the file with the extension .pl that is programming logic now prolog stands for programming logic so I already have a file that is the factor.pl now this particular file is used for uh, computing the factorial of a program now if you already have a file and you just click on it now uh, this is the window that is the editor window for uh, editing the programs or typing the programs now in this keep in mind that uh, the paste option won't work however you can copy it but paste option is not applicable in this so uh, this is the thing that you should remember now if I uh, do right here and uh, execute this uh, for computing the factorial as uh, say factorial of if I want to calculate the factorial of 3 and there is a dot after this this is a syntax now it will give you an error why because you have not compiled it for compiling it you have to go to this consult and now click on this and now try to execute this it will give you the answer now for entering the uh, next execution click on just enter now let us calculate the factorial of say uh, 12 factorial and a full stop and click enter it will give you the answer now let us see on changing the uh, variable x into small x now it's showing false why because all the variables are capital you have defined in your program that it is a, a capital function so it will not uh, accept a small in case of uh, if it is defined as capital and also uh, in place of x you can type any variable such as x or uh, a it will execute fine so no issues but keep in mind that you have to uh, type with uh, the capital uh, variable which you have defined in your original program so for example 14 comma uh, type y and a full stop should be there and each spaces should be kept very properly otherwise it will give you some error error is shown uh, right here at the uh, bottom line so hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you found this video helpful please hit the like button and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do subscribe thank you